Hello Capricorn, welcome to Miracle the Tribe. My name is Ayushi and I'm bringing you your May 2018 uh, messages. Uh, the, this is going to be for Capricorn Sun Moon Rising and this is a 10 card Celtic Cross. So guys, please uh, keep in mind that all the messages will not resonate. Uh, you have a flipper here. Uh, someone is either not contacting you or you have blocked someone or someone is uh, traveling towards you or has moved away from you like there is a long distance or because the card came out in reverse so probably they are uh, traveling towards you but mostly i f feel there is some blockage no movement delay Capricorn card so you are feeling very powerful and you feel uh, very much on your like you you feel very much in your own like power and uh, there is some disruption happening around you and you have been fighting a long drawn battle with some, some related to something let's see what what are the messages for Capricorn Sun Moon Rising May 2018 Right now, as I look, uh, it's 7-7 seven, seven right now on the clock. Okay. Yes, you are waiting for someone to come your way or someone is waiting for you, but uh, I don't think it's coming. Uh, for some of you, karma is at play. Like, um, I feel you are receiving karma or some karmic debt is happening. Because this card came out in reverse, I feel that um, you are not happy being single. Bottom of the deck, you are very focused and stubborn about something. Or you are dealing with an earth sign who is very stubborn right now. and Or you are dealing with someone who is being immature and they are not uh, paying attention to anyone around them or what they have to say. You are leaving a situation with a heavy heart which was not serving you something that uh, emotionally took a toll on you. It was an investment that has uh, not been uh, emotionally fulfilling for you. So uh, you are moving away to find your two of cups elsewhere because this particular situation hasn't served you. Give me a moment guys. My camera is a bit... Um, so what is what are the messages coming in for Capricorn Sun Moon Rising? Wow. So uh, I guess if you will leave a situation which was not serving you earlier, and you go in search of looking for that Two of Cups or the family, you want to complete your picture, like you want to complete the Ten of Cups. You don't want to stay in the Eight of Cups energy. You don't want to be. Uh, you don't want to feel emotionally dissatisfied. So. Uh, when you will uh, move away from that situation which was not serving you, I think uh, what's on your mind is that you want uh, complete fulfillment. Let's see if you will get it or not. Your challenge is that someone has been misleading you, uh, being deceptive towards you. They are hiding information. They are not sharing uh, important detail with you. So that is a challenge. You feel that someone is either withholding money or uh, this person is... Um, or you are feeling a lack of finances or uh, structure in your life you feel that you ha uh, don't have a place to go or you don't have a family or a home so you feel very left out in the cold someone has left here who was very deceptive you probably would work uh, wanting a uh, you wanted to start a family with this person probably and in past someone was holding their feeling back they were not opening up they were not sharing their feelings 
and on your mind there is a ego battle going on either in your head you are fighting a battle uh like i should have said this or um, something of that sort like um either you are feeling insecure don't mind please but uh, either that is happening or uh, you are dealing with someone who is feeling is insecure jealous and we they want to have undue control over you uh, or there is some ego battle that you are fighting with someone and uh, the card uh, the 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 card is saying that the uh, truth uh, needs to uh, be addressed here and the truth is that probably neither of you will realize what the truth is but the there needs to be a cutting of cord between the two of you because you guys want different things and uh, you are going in different direction both of you in future there is a betrayal so capricorn very heavy reading already you have betrayal you have a uh, five of pentacles feeling left out feeling betrayed fighting a ego battle with someone uh, being deceived by someone someone not sharing their feelings with you you wanting uh, ultimate bliss with this person this is totally contradicting uh, contradictory and uh, so you have a uh, uh, you know you you are uh, in touch with someone who is not on the same page with you and uh, but you are very very powerful and don't mind guys but i think you can also be the one doing all of the these things to someone else so um, there is something uh, you feel very powerful about like you feel that you can achieve whatever you want you feel that you can do whatever you want you feel infinite possibilities and everything will come your way if you have money and everything in place so you are feeling like that or uh, people are seeing you like this like people are envying you and stuff like that because you are so much uh, you are so much uh, you are doing so well in life that other people can't <laughs> bear the sight of it uh, because uh, you are doing so well you are emotionally fulfilled you probably uh, don't um, depend on anyone so that's why uh, people will do um, funny stuff like they will walk all over you and they will try to take your uh, power away by making you feel a certain way or they will just uh, most likely betray you by not sharing some uh, important detail with you or doing some petty stuff like holding back emotions or something of that sort in your surrounding uh, everything is balanced so karma is at play like i said and things will get balanced either you are dealing with a air sign libra aquarius gemini sun moon rising or you are dealing with a aries sun moon rising or you are dealing with a libra uh, person some of you are going through a divorce and uh, you are dealing with court issues and uh, it is related to money it is related to the fight between you two and it is related to how this person might in future betray you uh, and right now they are hiding something from you and that whatever that they are hiding is the reason for the betrayal that will so be mindful uh, if you are uh, in a court case uh, you need to be sure what you are sharing with the lawyer or what other people are uh, doing around that entire thing just be mindful of certain information which might go missing or something that is misinterpreted or something that is uh, misrepresented in your hopes and uh, desires uh, or fear you fear either a cancer person coming uh, and disrupting thing cancer sun moon rising or you hope that you have all your emotions physical spiritual uh, and every uh, aspect of your life just very very balanced and like you want everything to come into place so that you can move forward finally uh, with a vict a victorious energy like you need to feel very enthusiastic about your movement forward and you want that but uh, by the end of this month i don't think you are feeling like that you feel very emotionally dissatisfied you wanted more i if it's a court case i don't think you got what you deserved or whatever you wanted and um, uh let's see you are waiting for your ships to come in definitely you you have invested you have uh, put something that out there and you want it to come back uh, as it is like uh, whatever investment that is what is this dissatisfaction about what is this about what is this dissatisfaction so you are offering someone something and they are dissatisfied or you are dissatisfied now this thing is related to home or house uh and some thing related to passion like passion ace of wands so it can be uh, with a virgo person and someone who is uh, not 
corresponding to passion uh but th- something is being uh, balanced here like uh, like there is stability there is balance there is uh, some grounding and some celebration so even though you might not be feeling fully satisfied you will get uh, whatever that you deserve and because six of pentacles is here so there will be justice and since around you there is a justice card so justice will be done uh and you will have a new start with this because ace of uh, wands is also about starting something new planting something new uh, putting your ideas into action and it will take you a lot of enthusiasm and before a uh, lot of enthusiasm and energy but before that you will have to go within or you will uh, need to seek help of a um, someone who is um, very wise and very meticulous very professional but a uh, magician again here so you are dealing with an expert here by the end of the month uh, like you are making very uh, professional decisions what is this uh, so you are fearing that uh, you won't be able to leave a situation which was holding you back you feel that you will keep uh, uh, you will be in a illusion whatever was and how good it was uh, you you can be dealing with a uh, gemini or a water sign uh, you fear that your emotions will not be balanced you fear that uh, you will not feel emotionally uh, stable and you are also afraid of all the um, choices that you have in front of you because you don't know which one is good sorry guys about the train so guys i'm sorry i'm a little bit um i you know because of the train i got distracted so uh, uh, you fear that someone is not going to open up about their emotion or you also fear that uh, whatever choices that you will have uh, you won't know what which one is good for you and which one is bad um, i also see that you are defending yourself like you will uh, you will not settle for less and you you are fearing that you will have to settle for less a uh, nine of swords in the bottom so you do have your fears uh, like lot of fear like you fear that you will lose money and you will be left out in the cold and finances you are very worried, worried about finances through and through so if you are worried too much your uh, worries will manifest so don't uh, um, worry that much because that is counterproductive uh with this court case or this decision or this separation something is weighing heavy on you you feel it can be related to work something related to work so it's you hope that someone will uh, cooperate you hope that uh, people will um hold their end of the bargain like you hope that someone will uh, be justice like someone will uh, do justice you hope that someone will uh, move away silently or and you hope that someone will forgive the situation and let go you uh, it can be a scorpio so you are hoping that someone will make a wise call uh, whatever decision and some of you are dealing with your soulmate here so that is why it is making it more difficult because uh, you might not want anything bad for this person uh, or this person doesn't want anything bad for you and you hope that they will uh, have mutual respect and uh, love for you but guys i will tell you people are seeing you as a deceptive one you as a tricky one people are seeing you as someone who is betraying them or someone who is holding information uh, in fact i also have that feeling because first of all in your own reading you are coming up as um, don't mind guys but as a magician seven of swords Uh, you also come up as someone um, who has lot of desires uh, and very emotional as well so it can be someone wishy washy so people are seeing you someone who has lot of dreams and uh, desires and someone who is very emotional who c- cannot take care of their emotion um 
someone uh, you can also be seen as someone who is very selfless of your self like you are very selfless uh i don't know if people are saying you as someone who is deceptive uh, uh i think you are just either you are just being misunderstood so you need to um, communicate about that if it's safe otherwise just leave because how how does it matter uh, what other people think about you bottom of the deck is the wheel of fortune so things will take time and they will happen in their own time so don't rush things in case you are what is this betrayal about for capricorn in future what is this betrayal about for capricorn what is this betrayal so someone is going to come your way or they are going to communicate something with you and uh, it will be told to you via uh, email or uh, you could be dealing with a leo person or you will get to know that someone uh, has a child with a gemini person or someone has chosen someone else like a leo person what is this betrayal with sun card here something will come to light in future like i was saying there is some secrecy and whatever is being held it will come to light it is uh, regarding a family definitely this is i feel a wife card so there is some betrayal definitely give me more clarity okay so some betrayal will happen something suddenly will come to an end and uh, yeah something suddenly will come to an end because you have the tar card so something some clarity will come sun is here you will feel happy about it you will feel okay finally something has come to light and now i know where i stand uh, now i can focus on myself on my uh, growth and uh, abundance so you will get lot of clarity but of course it will be painful because uh, you will uh, see the true colors of someone and you will have to be very patient uh, as you move forward so someone is uh, who whoever is fighting with you here uh, or whatever ego battle is going on it can be with a air sign who is very air sign or a uh, aries leo sagittarius who is being a little bit immature or this battle or fight is about a child so let's see so you are waiting for a offer like a passionate offer or a child um, karmic relationship this person uh, this if is if this is a child i think your child is not choosing you or you are not liking what your child is doing or there is someone around you who is immature and you are not liking what they are doing they are being immature they are rejecting a offer that is being made to them but it is all karmic this person is, has a karmic relationship like this person is from your previous life uh, and you are very hopeful about it but it's it is what it is so uh, this what is this uh, financial uh, lack and what is this um, uh, out who is left out in the poll and what is this financial lack and support the person uh, who op someone who was hiding their emotions or not uh, sharing their money or someone who was um, keeping things to themselves uh, this person opened up and when they opened up they probably told you that they want to stay single or you opened up and uh, you told them that you want to stay single and then that is why someone is feeling left out in the cold and uh, there is a lot of competition probably this person uh, feels that they have so many offers or they are just flirt basically in some way they are yes there can be a three party situation with a leo aries or a sagittarius uh either this person is uh holding money from you or you are holding money from this person or this person is leaving you out in the cold or you will leave this person out in the cold uh there is a three party situation definitely or uh, someone is uh, someone is confused about their feelings like uh, uh what is this king of wands 
सो यू लॉस सम वन हु वॉज ए फायर साइन और हु वॉज वेरी करिज्मेटिक वेरी वेल नोन इन अ वे एंड यू इट्स इट्स ओवर एंड यू आर क्राइंग ओवर स्पिल्ट मिल्क और दिस पर्सन इज क्राइंग ओवर यू समथिंग हैज नॉट वर्कड आउट हियर एंड सम वन इज हीलिंग फ्रॉम दैट सिचुएशन दे हैव बिन क्राइंग ओवर इट एंड इट हैज बिन डिस्ट्रेसिंग दैम लेट्स सी वट दिस सीक्रेट इज अबाउट वट इज दिस सीक्रेट दैट इज बींग हेल्प फ्रॉम केपिकॉन वट इज दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन और सीक्रेट और नॉट समथिंग दैट इज बींग हेल्प फ्रॉम केपिकॉन मे टू थाउजेंड एंड एटीन सन मून राइजिंग सो द सीक्रेट इज दैट इधर देर इज अ टॉरिस्ट पर्सन हु इज द थर्ड पार्टी एंड दे हैव टोल्ड सम वन दैट दे लाइक लाइक सम वन हैज टोल्ड दैम और दे हैव टोल्ड सम वन दैट दे लाइक दैम लाइक दे हैव फीलिंग्स फॉर दैम एंड देर इज अ बैटल लाइक सम वन इज नॉट गिविंग अप on their marriage in spite of the fact that uh, someone is di- like like a commitment is there but someone is within the commitment someone is making an offer to someone else and one person is stuck around fighting about something like they want they don't want to let go and they still want time and uh, whatever it is guys it is very uh, immature these are with the feelings which are not mature it can be just infatuation so someone uh, in marriage court or at office a religious institution uh, someone is um, not true about their feelings there is a new beginning someone is offering universe is offering a new beginning to you now it if it it's up to you if you want to get entangled in all the issues that is that are surrounding you or you want to start something new related to finances uh, so there is an opportunity give me what is this 10 of cups for capricorn sun moon rising you are very emotional about someone you want to offer your love to someone um you want you are keeping your feelings hidden from this person you uh, either want to nurture yourself or you want to nurture this person you can be dealing with a pisces or a water sign you want to have a, f- a new start with someone who is uh, who's showing interest in you uh, but you are probably vibrating higher than this person whoever this is so this person can be younger or they are um, they still have to uh, bring something concrete to the table so you are ha- you are not sharing your emotions yet with this person who is holding back the emotions in the past who is holding back who is not opening up in the past and what is it about so someone was not uh, sharing their emotions money or whatever uh, they were keeping it to themselves because it it took took them lot of effort to keep it to themselves um, or it would have taken them lot of effort to open up uh it could be a pisces person uh but um this person could have been doing this because uh, they wanted to uh, remain at the top of the game uh so they didn't want to lose their um adm- admiration or uh, people liking them and stuff like that so that's why they were just holding back and you could be dealing with a leo as well um it took you a lot of strength to deal with this person and to come out victorious after all that new love is uh, on the cards uh, which is ace of cups so you you have a new love coming in below that you have the world card end of anxiety look at all the anxiety that you are going through and you had a three party situation or a heartbreak before that and you were in a karmic relationship this is also a capricorn card but also a karmic bondage or a addiction you were dealing with someone who was harsh cutting or you have to you were very patient with this person so you have to now let them go because world card is here the chapter has ended new beginning new love you need to give a chance to new love so what is uh, blocking capricorn sun moon rising
of you are on a quest like after everything uh, you are looking for your answers some of you are dealing with gossip like people are gossiping about your situation or you are just getting caught up in gossip believing all the rumors uh, despondence you feel very hopeless about the situation but uh, be aware that uh, don't uh, block destiny like um, accept the things that uh, the way they are happening the uh, the sooner you will accept it the better it will be for you so don't ho hold on or don't delay the um, don't delay the um, process of uh, letting things be and letting being okay with the things that how they, with the way they are uh, because um, that is not going to serve you now let's pull out one advice card capricorn sun moon rising what you want wants you so whatever that you are thinking about or you are sending energy towards that is what will get attracted to you so what you want is want you and sacred pool like i said some of you are in a sacred journey after all this uh, you will uh, have a spiritual awakening some of you because you had a uh, hermit card uh, by the end of this reading Capricorn I hope the reading was helpful for you if it was kindly do drop me a comment it would help me to assess how I am doing as a reader so do drop me a comment i'll see you next month bye bye